Have you ever faced a storm? I sure have. Life throws curveballs, and sometimes it feels like the wind is howling and the rain is pouring. It's in those moments that we need a solid foundation, a rock to cling to. And here's the beautiful thing. God isn't just any rock. He's the rock of ages. He's been there from the beginning, and he'll be there until the end. A timeless truth from Psalm chapter 18, verse 2, which says, The Lord is my rock and my fortress and my deliverer, my God, my rock in whom I take refuge, my shield and the horn of my salvation, my stronghold. Now, that's a mouthful, but if you catch the essence, it's a declaration of the Lord being our unshakable foundation, our refuge in times of trouble. The Lord is my rock in whom I take refuge. Imagine standing on a rock, a solid, unmovable surface. That's what it's like when we make the Lord our refuge. When life's storms come, and they will, we stand on the rock of ages, unshaken and secure. Say it with me. The Lord is my rock and my fortress, my deliverer, my shield, and the horn of my salvation. I take refuge in Him, my stronghold. My life is built on the rock of ages, unmovable and secure. In Psalm chapter 125, verse 1, the Bible drops this gem. Those who trust in the Lord are like Mount Zion, which cannot be moved but abides forever. Imagine being compared to something that can't be shaken, that stands strong forever. That's you when you put your trust in the Lord. So when the Bible tells us that those who trust in the Lord are like Mount Zion, it's not just a poetic analogy. It's a powerful declaration of the significance of putting your trust in God. Everything else may falter, but when you lean on the Lord, you become unmovable like Mount Zion. Let's break this down a bit. Think about the things you usually put your trust in. Maybe your job, your finances, relationships. Now these are good things, but they're not unshakable. They're not eternal. Only Jesus Christ can save you. Only He can be your true source of peace and comfort. Sure, having money is great, but it won't save your soul. Diet and exercise are fantastic for your health, but your soul needs Jesus. The key here is trust. Placing your trust in the one who is eternal, the rock that cannot be moved. It's about standing on solid ground, always firm, because greater is he who is in you than he who is in the world. That's a promise you can count on. Let's dive into some more scripture because, let's be honest, there's nothing more reassuring than God's word. Jeremiah chapter 17 verses 7 to 8 says, Blessed is the man who trusts in the Lord and whose hope is the Lord. For he shall be like a tree planted by the waters, which spreads out its roots by the river and will not fear when heat comes but its leaf will be green and will not be anxious in the year of drought, nor will cease from yielding fruit. Picture this, you're like a tree, deeply rooted, strong, and unmovable. Trusting in God provides that kind of stability. And check this out from Proverbs chapter 29, verse 25. The fear of man brings a snare but whoever trusts in the Lord shall be safe. Safety in trust. It's a sweet deal, right? In Isaiah 26 verse 3, it's even more explicit. You will keep him in perfect peace, whose mind is stayed on you because he trusts in you. Perfect peace? 
Sign me up. Trusting in the Lord brings a peace that surpasses all understanding. Remember this. Those who trust in the Lord are like Mount Zion, unmovable and standing firm. They're like trees planted by the waters, safe and deeply rooted. They're kept in perfect peace because their trust is in the Lord. It's a powerful truth that transforms our perspective and anchors our souls. Now let's take a moment to declare God's word over our lives. Say it out loud with me. I am like Mount Zion. I am unmovable and stand firm because I trust in the Lord. My trust is in Jesus Christ, the rock of ages. I am like a tree planted by the waters, safe, deeply rooted and unshaken by life's challenges. I am kept in perfect peace because my mind is stayed on the Lord. I declare safety and stability in every area of my life because I trust in the one who is eternal. Let's ask for God's blessing. Please join me in this prayer. Gracious and merciful Father, Creator of the universe, we humbly come before your majestic presence. We acknowledge you as the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the unchanging rock upon which we stand. Your word declares in Psalm 18 verse 2 that you are our rock, our fortress, our deliverer, and our refuge. In times of tumult, we find solace in the assurance that you are our unshakable foundation. Lord, life often feels like a tempest with winds howling and rain pouring down. Yet, in the midst of the storm, we take comfort in knowing that you are not just any rock. You are the rock of ages. From the dawn of time to the end of days, you remain steadfast and unwavering. As we declare, the Lord is my rock and my fortress, my deliverer, my shield and the horn of my salvation, my stronghold. We are anchoring our souls in your eternal strength. Psalm 125 verse 1 compares those who trust in you to Mount Zion an unmovable force enduring through ages. When we place our trust in earthly things, jobs, finances, relationships, they may falter. But when we lean on you, we become unmovable, just like Mount Zion. You, Lord, are the only source of true peace and comfort. As we trust in you, we stand on solid ground, always firm, knowing that greater is he who is in us than he who is in the world. In Jeremiah 17 verses 7 to 8, we discover the blessedness of trusting in the Lord. Like a tree planted by the waters, we spread our roots by the river, unafraid when heat comes, unwavering in the year of drought. Our trust in you, O Lord, provides stability, even in the most challenging seasons. Proverbs 29 verse 25 reminds us that the fear of man brings a snare, but whoever trusts in the Lord shall be safe. Safety in trust, what a sweet assurance. Isaiah 26 verse 3 speaks of perfect peace for those whose minds are stayed on, you because they trust in you. Lord, we declare this perfect peace over our lives. In a world filled with uncertainties, our trust in you brings a peace that surpasses all understanding. We stand firm, deeply rooted, unmovable, and kept in perfect peace because our trust is in you. Now, as we lift our voices in unity, let us declare over our lives, 
I am like Mount Zion. I am unmovable and stand firm because I trust in the Lord. My trust is in Jesus Christ, the rock of ages. I am like a tree planted by the waters, safe, deeply rooted and unshaken by life's challenges. I am kept in perfect peace because my mind is stayed on the Lord. I declare safety and stability in every area of my life because I trust in the one who is eternal. Heavenly Father, we conclude this moment of prayer by asking for your abundant blessings to flow into our lives. Guide us, protect us, and lead us according to your perfect will. May our lives be a testament to your faithfulness, and may we continually find our strength and security in you. In the powerful and matchless name of Jesus, we pray. Amen.